each community matters when it comes to election and one community which has been overlooked over the years this time around finally gets recognition watch this report on how the transgenders in goa for the very first time will be casting their votes as a recognized category 40 year old zareen is a transgender in madgaon area of goa she has never cast her vote but 2022 is going to be different for her she was to get a voter identity card in 2000 that year 18 year old zareen left her home in search of her identity it took her 22 years to get a voter identity card that recognizes her as a transgender anek kism ke log milte hain hame jo dukhwar mane ke ekdam harka dete hain ki ye kya cheez hai ye kya hai tumhare paas kuch job nahi hai tum job nahi kar sakte ho to hum usse kya bole to kehte hain ki sarkar ke paas jao to hum kehte hain sarkar ab jab hame sarkar aa samne se afsos karenge jab to hum jayenge aise kaise jayenge eight others like zareen have got their voter identity card in 2022 for the first time they would be part of the electoral process 20 saalon mein first time jo goa mein hamari ek election aayegi bani hai hum bahut khush hain iske liye ki hamara bhi kuch apna pehchan patra hai garv hai jo main 14 february ko pehla apna vot dene jaungi 45 year old heena is excited she will cast her vote for the first time on 14th of february she feels if the identity crisis hadn't been there in society she and many others would have established themselves in society meri jo aage wali peedi hai jo maine sacrifice kiye jo maine problems uthaye ye mere aane wali peedi ke liye aisa na ho isliye main aur khush hu ki mere zariye abhi aage sabke kaam ho jayenge heena hopes for a better future for herself and the community jana de jo hua so acha hi hua mujhe to yahi khushi hai ki der aaye durusta hai I think it is a, indeed a privilege for us also that we have been truly able to make the elections inclusive in the true sense. This election in Goa, at least nine transgenders will be casting their votes with seven being in South Goa. The state government has identified at least 100 cases in the state but the problem is most of these people are still scared to come out in the open. I think it is for the first time that the transgenders, they are going to cast their vote. And more than the vote, what is important is that they are being identified. They have got their identity as transgenders. Issuing of the voter ID card is a welcome move. But the government will now have to draw a road map. Chalk out a forward-looking policy. Design welfare schemes if it has to ensure honest integration and all round development of these people we have been able to deliver to their expectations and provide uh, the voter card to all the transgenders who applied for it this process is ongoing all through the year the uh, enrollment happens as voters and the we are partnering with the ngo so that they can come up with more transgenders who can enroll themselves as voters on valentine's day these people will start a new chapter in their lives and inspire others to step forward bureau report india today